Yo, so I'm back in here for another edition of Your Mother. Right here on the screen, what in the cross colors, colors, fresh, menace to society, shit that we got right here, right? Some boys in the hood, fucking pants. Um, now, everybody that watches my videos know that I speak against gang, be, like being in the gang. And once upon a time, the Crips and Buzz was helping the community. Fast forward 60 years later, they don't do that shit. That's not what its function is. It's a motherfucking organized street organization that handles criminal activity by and large, right? They might give out turkeys and backpacks and shit like that. But for the most part, they probably running, you know what I'm saying, running hoes, drugs, and guns. I know real gang members. I know what the fuck it look like. But Timu is on some wild shit. They over here peddling some goddamn MAC-10 Inglewood motherfucking blood red looks like jogger pants. They gonna get somebody motherfucking paralyzed from the waist down. They You gonna fuck around going to the wrong neighborhood and get shot in the waist and be in a wheelchair for the rest of your life like that nigga from Oz. <laughs> Let me just put a disclaimer out here for the young boys. Don't let that gang shit go to your head. You is not Mac-10, Lil Wayne, Chris Brown, Soldier Boy, or any of these nut-ass niggas that claim that they blooded out and all this. You ain't Cardi B. You wear these shits, your ass gonna be in a cardigan and a blazer put in a casket and get airlifted to the ground. <laughs> Stop fucking playing with your life. And Timo, stop leading motherfuckers down the road of destruction. You put these shits on your ass, better live in Omaha, Nebraska. Because if you live in L.A. or New York or even Atlanta, and you fuck around where these shits in Atlanta, you fuck around running the risk of getting east and west side stomped in any of it. I hope people is listening to me. But in the words of DMX, they don't hear me, though. And I'm out. No, no.